Green light. Merrifield to Bichette. And basement, it was hitting a spot where they were going to have a difficult time turning two, and Bo made a right decision, not trying to force it. Six, seven, and eights, too. They are making them work. But it's well back in the seats, and Gosman way out in front of and two. Well, with six for 20. Inside. One ball and two strikes. And pass to Diving Guerrero. Might have gotten a piece of it with his at bat. An upper hand, as far as they know what's coming, they're just hitting good pitches. Fair ball, and that's the third out. Martinez telling you you've been the winner. It would be my pleasure to call you, so make sure you log on and buy some more tickets. A pleasure, too. <laughs> it would be fun. That's very kind of you, but <laughs> can you imagine that spot today? Brendan Bernardino is back on the mound, and it gets a pop-up to first, one down. Kind of May, June, and into July last year. Second half was not like the first half. But obviously, we have seen it. Terrific offensive numbers when you put their numbers together and what they did as a tandem behind the plate. Sweeping breaking ball winds up way outside. 2 0 on Kevin Kiermeyer as, as well. Kiermeyer's got a base hit in the left field. It's aboard. And George Springer is not going to face Brennan Bernardino. It doesn't look faced four batters. George Springer was actually the first batter he faced. Springer popped up. Start. They've slowed down dramatically. You know, even the Tigers, the Blue Jays are going to. Up the middle, and right there is Bichette playing just to the left of second base. Are the Rays and the Twins and the Rangers? The Orioles are in a pretty good spot. They've got the top wild card spot, and they have held it. Back of the Orioles in the loss column. I think that's the number that counts because eventually everybody's going to catch up in the equal number. Out of it, do we have enough player depth to make some trades? The Blue Jays are done with the app. And Hernandez strikes out. Number seven for Kevin Gosman. David Hamilton shows bunt and takes a strike. Play last year. Doesn't go Gosman's way. One and one. The two one. Kirk coming back for a look, but it's in the seat. Grounded to first. Guerrero finds it and wins the race. He's older than Vladdy, basically, about two more seasons of experience. But if you look at their numbers, they're going to play a lot against each other throughout their career. Devers in Boston and Vladdy here in Toronto, of course. The Devers thing is really interesting, though, because there was a lot of backlash after Bogart's big revenue team, obviously. Swing and a miss by Guerrero. And it's one and one. He got Connor Wong with a backswing. In yeah. New England. Glad he thought it was low. It's one and two. Yeah, this breaking ball right at the bottom of the zone. Yeah. Borderline pitch. Could have gone either way. And it goes in the red sock. And he would figure to be a guy who can give Alex Cora. Fastball lined and a nice play made by Hamilton. It's Curveball stays high ball one to Matt Chapman who struck out his first time up. Rounded down to third. Devers up with it. And another good play by Devers. No longer a junior J. Varsho now 27 years old. Again his birthday today. He hit a flop. Well you and I played a little game before the game today. That I think a ton of blue chief hitting fifth behind Vladdy. The Red Sox thought that Varsha went, but he. So who would hit first? I, well, you could hit Bo first. I think you could hit with Merrifield first, and he's hitting in that third spot. And he's had a lot of strikeouts. Yeah, he hit a home run today, but that was his first moved him into the third spot, but he's cooled off some since. Because at the beginning it was Springer, Bichette, Vladdy, Chapman, right? Yeah. When Chapman. And he's very good at it. I'm not suggesting that they could do better than Springer in the leanoff spot. 
But then again, I'm sitting up here next to you, <laughs> so that doesn't really have an impact. Yeah. Good spot. But what would you say to Bichette Guerrero Springer, putting Springer? Th That's why the number two spot, you've seen a lot of impact bats in that number two spot. How about Matt Olson? What he's done lately? He's got 10 home runs in two and two now in Merrifield. Fly ball to right field. Verdugo going back, and he'll make the break. Then the Diamondbacks and Padres come to town to open up the second half before the always fun. Shirts and Bowden and Francis recently. They're going to need it once more before the break. They have already announced regular rest. And then the the fifth spot on Saturday before Baxter. Yeah, it would be an opportunity to give him that extra day's rest. And it doesn't make any difference to the opener. The, what they're going to do. I mean, there is the long term possibility and you know dominates, throws a lot of strikes and gets his breaking ball over. He might become an option. Change my opinion on when he might get back if if he pitches well and Pitches and throws opportunity. New Hampshire. Here's Jaron Duran bidding for his third double of the game, and he's three double game of the season already in 24 on the season in all. Turner looks at a strike at 98. And the bullpen's going, Buck. Tim. May Well, it's interesting if you look at where they are in the lineup. For Slow bouncer to short. Bichette has it. You know, in the Mesa part of the equation, too, obviously, with each reliever, they look for parts in the lineup where they think to try to get as deep into the game as you can. Now to play left side, two and one. Now we had mentioned. 97 at the knees, two and two. That'll always ball. 98 right there. It's it's impressive. You know what? He, he he's a little bit like baseball is a sport you can't muscle. It's more like a ballet than a. I mean, in football, you can pack on 30. You see, that's why all those numbers on four days rest and five. Two two again. Splitter in the dirt and now full. 3 2. Line drive center field. Keir Myers there. 11 a.m. Pacific time on Sportsnet and Sportsnet now. Seven strikeouts through five innings, but you're right. They made him work. They made him throw a lot of pitches, but once again, popped up his first time up. Huh? Rounded to short. One down. 